Hi there, Steve Brosman from the Social Marketing Channel. We've got a treat today. We're coming to you live from the beautiful Bathers Restaurant at lovely Balmoral. In fact, just upstairs is where at Pam Brosman and I got married. Um, you wanted to know that, didn't you, Jeff? Uh, maybe too much information. <laughs> <laughs> we have Jeff Bullis with us today, and Jeff has been in social media for quite some time. Tell us how you got started and some of the channels that you're actually using. Um, some of the channels I originally got involved with was uh, Facebook. Mm -hmm. Um, and I realised the how people were so obsessed by it almost, and I said, well, this is really interesting to see how many people were using it right. and how they were using it. So I said, well, there has to be some power behind it, seeing how people were using it and uh, the number of people were joining. And the ability to link, uh, to invite your uh, you know, ex-university friends to join you. Um, so yeah, I was just uh, astonished, frankly, at the power of the, of the of the platform. Yeah. We actually uh, got in touch with you, you were introduced with, uh, to Pam via Twitter and you, uh, you do a lot of tweets out with uh, some fantastic information. Can you explain a bit about that? Yeah, Twitter I uh, got introduced to last December and uh, it was fairly dormant for two or three months. Um, but then I really wanted to put up a blog so, and then I started investigating Twitter more mm -hmm. um, and I thought, yes, yeah, just about, you know, what did I have for dinner last night? <laughs> But it's much more than that. It's very um, powerful, isn't it? Yeah, the ability to uh, converse with other people on the other side of the world, to engage. Um, I actually have met people from the US and converse with them regularly. Uh, Ex-mayor of New Jersey. Uh, wow. just, yeah, so it gives you an idea of just the, the level of connectivity it can give you engagement. Yeah. Now let's talk about your blog because uh, that's probably what you're more renowned for and the, the great information that you send out and you post on that. Can you give us some information about that? Yeah, well, social media, when, when I discovered its, um, its power, I suppose I was, so I just wanted to write about it. Um, I love learning, um, mm -hmm. I love finding out information, and then I like sharing it. Um, and so the blog is about sharing information that I find interesting, and also I, I do kick tabs on the traffic on it to see what people respond to. So I, I really, uh, and things like facts and figures, uh, where social media is going. All those sorts of things, um, they, they intrigue people and uh, I use Twitter to actually let people know when I've got a new blog, mm -hmm. blog post out. So it's a platform which is what I call my home base. Uh, what, what is uh, some of the most popular blogs that you put up? What type of those blogs do, do people most respond to? Um, one type of blog that works well are list type blogs where yep. you say, 20 ways to get found on Twitter, or um, mega lists is popular. I've just put one out recently. Mm -hmm. It's it just gives people how tos, you know, really like I suppose bite size um, article. Yeah, I've got to say that you save us a lot of time. Oh, thank because, you. <laughs> because we follow you all the time, and if if I find you first or Pam finds you first, it's like, hey, look what Jeff's put out. This has saved us a lot of time looking for this information. So uh, on behalf of us. You do save us a lot of time, and, and that's why your blog, your blog is so popular. Now, how do they find your blog? Um, um, my blog is jeffpullis.com, so that's quite simple. Yep. Uh, just my name, .com. And we can uh, find you on Twitter as at jeffpullis. That's right. B-U-L-L. Yeah. A-S. A-S. I was waiting for you to finish that. That's right. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> now, you've also just stuck your toe in the water with a little bit of video. Yep. Uh, can you tell us why and, and how you're finding it? And for those at home, yes, we are in a real live restaurant, and if the, uh, the background noise there, it's, it's not me dropping plates, it's those cooking in the kitchen. Yeah. Um, I just came across some numbers on YouTube mm -hmm. um, and online video just recently. In fact, it's something I've been keeping an eye on for the last few months, but one that came across uh, my computer screen just recently was in the US alone, in the month of August, there were over 25 billion views on online video. That's, that's, that's standard. Yeah, I know, and I said that must be a typo, but it's not. <laughs> um, that's from Comscore. Mm -hmm. um, the other thing that uh, was interesting too was, um, YouTube is actually the second largest search engine in the world behind Google. Yeah. So if you want to be found online, and you're optimising to be found on Google, you can't ignore YouTube. It really is significant, and it is still growing at an, at an incredible pace. Since yeah. December last year, it's actually grown at over 78% just in eight months. 
Yeah. One of the statistics that uh, that we found uh, last month was was last month 60% uh, of all the downloaded information from the net as a whole was videos. Yep. And a lot of people, as you said, search YouTube instead of going to Google. A lot of people was uh, a recipe for this, and a recipe for that. Instead of getting the recipe, they can actually go to YouTube and watch somebody cook it and say that's fantastic. That's the way people are starting to think now. I don't want to read. I'll just sit and watch. Yeah. Well, the other interesting thing that I think people aren't aware of is that this what I call the new rules of marketing, mm -hmm. which have emerged in the last few years and become really quite um, uh, powerful in the last 12 months to 24 months. Um, if you want to be found, if you want your business to be found, do you go to the yellow pages of print media these days, or do you go online? So, if you're not getting found online, then how are you going to get found? And that's the real power behind social media, search engine optimization, and blogging, um, and optimizing your site, your website, or blog. Well, you keep up the good work. You keep saving us lots of time because we keep going to your blog and we keep reading your tweets, and you do keep putting out some fantastic I don't, I don't have a life. So. <laughs> uh, fantastic. Thanks for coming in today. We, I know we're going to go and uh, have a great coffee overlooking the water. So stay in touch with Jeff at Jeff Bullis on Twitter and jeffbullis.com. Follow the blog. It's some fantastic information and get out there and do your video marketing. Steve and Jeff from the Social Marketing Channel. We'll see you next time. Cheers.